Hello guys, what's going on? My name is Caitlin, you're number one girls across YouTuber, and in this video, I'm doing something that was highly requested. I'm showing you guys the best sticks for beginner women's lacrosse players. Alright, so starting off, the first beginner stick that you've probably all heard of if you've play, played lacrosse before, it's that one that, it's, the S, it's by STX, it comes with like the bag and the goggles. If you don't know what I'm talking about, here's a picture. It's called the STX Nova is the name of the stick. Um, it's that one that's like pretty much like a tennis racket and you can't really loosen it or it becomes illegal. So yeah, if, if you have that stick, it's fine for a beginner stick, but you are probably going to want to upgrade. The first beginner stick that I recommend is the, the Under Armour Blitz. Um, the Under Armour Blitz, here's a picture. It's a great stick for beginners because not only um, does it have a slimmer profile which will allow you to have a deeper pocket which will make catching easier to learn. It's not like a junk stick like you know some beginner sticks can be kind of like it doesn't really seem like it's going to last you very long kind of plasticky. Um, the Under Armour Blitz is great quality for a cheap price and it's going to be great for a beginner. Right now it's either 40 or 50 dollars I'm not sure um, it's a great deal for a complete woman's stick and it's going to be great a great stick to get you started. Another beginner stick I highly recommend is also by Under Armour. It's called the Under Armour's Desire. I think the Under Armour Desire is slightly better than the Under Armour Blitz, um, but they're probably both pretty similar. Um, they're great sticks, they have similar perks to them, and yeah, Under Armour Desire is going for $39.99 right now, which is a great deal. Um, if you want to get a stick for a beginner stick for Christmas, I highly recommend the Under Armour Desire. The next stick I recommend is the Brian Girls Dynasty Rise. Now, I myself use the um, Brian Dynasty Elite. Um, the Brian Dynasty Rise is kind of an intro to that. Um, I love the Dynasty Elite, um, but the Dynasty Rise is going to be a good intro for beginners, a great stick to learn your skills with, and then it won't be that much of a change when you upgrade to a better stick, more tailored to your position once you figure that all out. Um, like the Brian Dynasty Elite is what I have. It's meant for like attackers and midfielders. Brian Dynasty Rise is going to give you the same quality the Brian Dynasty Elite has, um, just in a more general stick that will be great for all positions because as a beginner you really don't know the position you're going to be playing yet. The final beginner stick I recommend, it's a little bit of a step up from all the other um, beginner sticks I've mentioned, but if you're looking to keep your, like if you're not going to be, if you don't want to upgrade after like a couple years after you get a beginner stick, this would be a good um, stick to get um, because it will be it will work well for beginners, but it will also work well um, as you um, grow in lacrosse. It's the STX Crux Complete Woman Stick. The pinch head shape probably isn't best for beginners since it's going to be a smaller area to catch with, um, but the pocket is very forgiving that comes with it, so it will be good um, to learn how to cradle and. Um, really get a forgiving learn a forgiving catch style so the ball stays in your stick because the big problem with a lot of beginners woman sticks is that they're not made well so basically the head is like this wide and the pocket is like here and the you have to be able to see the ball above the plastic so when the head is already this thick it's really hard to get any much of a pocket and it ends up being like a tennis racket for most girls um so yeah i hope this video helped it's showing you guys some other good options for um, beginner women's lacrosse sticks. I'll talk to you guys in the next video and let me know if you want to see like best sticks for defenders, best sticks for midfielders, best sticks for attackers. Um, basically once you once you become a more experienced player and you want to know a stick for your position. Alright, thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.